Oh, there we go. Okay, focus. Focus on the bird bum. Whoa, good morning. Good morning. What are we doing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Today's the day. The burb is going back to the vet. So yeah, so this is gonna be our follow-up visit um, from I think the last video I did with my burb. She's going in today for an ultrasound to have the little lump uh, checked out on her abdomen. I hope that it's nothing serious. So if you guys, well, after you see this, I'll already know the results, but send my burb the good vibes regardless, right? All right. Oh, into the sunshine. Let's do this, pal. Yeah, good job. Look about that. Whoa, check this all out, huh? Come on, Kim. Good boy. Are you surviving in there? I know, it's a little stressful, hey? Where are we going? Are we going to the vet? Uh oh. Cool, so we dropped off uh, the bird. And, um, all right, peace. Peace. And now we're heading home because it's gonna be so our appointment was at 11.30, um, but it's gonna be a while because she's having an x-ray and or ultrasound done. So she's had that done before and it's taken a couple of hours. So we're just like, well, we'll just go home and then, um, and then come out. It's hot in here though, baby. Bubble, bubble, no, bubble, it's too hot. <laughs> All right. Hope the I don't, through. it's fine. You'll hear me or you won't hear me. I'll put subtitles. So yeah, so we're gonna go home, hang out with the dog for a little bit, um, make sure he's all cool and happy. And then uh, we'll give them a call at 2.30 to see what the status is. I think she hasn't, like, she acts totally normal, so. But that's what birds do. Birds do this. They just act normal until they're dying. And then you're like, oh, so you're sick. Thank you for letting me know. Anyways, um, all that time. Because that's what birds do. They don't want to get picked well, off by yeah, predators, right. so that they pretend they that they're okay. Yeah. yeah, until they physically cannot act normal anymore. So it's physically an interesting thing. Cannot. Physically cannot even. Um, yeah. So that's that's. I know we're just that awesome. Okay, we'll see you guys in the next clip. Are you excited that we're home? You checking to make sure your butt's still attached? Oh. Hi. Okay, so because we do um, a more thorough clean, or I just did a really thorough clean on her cage, I just did a little spot. A little spot cleaning. So this is like the minimum amount of work that I would ever do. But if it gets real like build up, then I will do the whole thing washed in the tub. But I literally just did her cage like a couple of days ago in the tub. So that got all washed. So the, the toys that we're gonna replace, I think, are gonna be this one. Uh, this guy she really likes. I'm not gonna get rid of that guy. Um, possibly this one and then this one down here. So the box of toys that we have is in the um, living room but I want to do a little unboxing video because you guys seem to like that last time so and here's her little play gym which also got a nice cleaning uh, the other day so pretty good <laughs> all right I'm testing out Alfie's new filming corner the guy is over there and his chair is over here I used to film facing the other way but I don't like the lighting I still hate the lighting here but I just wanted to see if I could get this back far enough See, you're right up against my TV, right? But I think that looks a little bit nicer. 
because then I'm sitting here. I can interact with the guy here and then hopefully his subtitles when he talks will fit here or like here. It's kind of hard because I do them white and then they don't really show up like on his chair. So maybe if I move him like this or something, let's see. Alfie, come. Alfie, chair. Good boy. That's my brave boy. That's my brave little chicken buns. Gentle, ah, that's better. We know how to do it gently. We know how to do it gently, guys. See, but it still doesn't feel like you're close enough to us. Like you're not really like, cause he looks, I mean, he is really small. It's really funny, like this um, company that makes these really cool uh, carabiner like leashes contacted me and they were like, oh, your dog's really cute. Can you send us some pictures? I'm like, dude, your carabiners are like like this big and I'm pretty sure that like, if you see how, this is, you can't tell like on his Instagram how small he is, but he's actually tiny. Like, look how little he is. He's just like a little guy. He's just like a little bean. His little toe beans are so small, they're smaller than the tip of my pinky. Oh, are you okay? What are you looking at? You can hear daddy outside? You can hear daddy outside. I know, this is so serious. Can you pound it? That's my boy right there. Ooh, can you see it in my glasses? That's so trippy. So I got a light and I'm trying to see if there's a place I can put it to like light us better. Does that pass for fake daylight or what? That's just crazy. All right, so this is just my little test to see if my new setup is gonna work. I kind of wish you couldn't see the light reflecting from over here in my glasses, but what are you gonna do? Oh my God, he's not freaking out. Wow, good job. Good job, buddy. Wow. Hey, Eric, are you impressed? Yeah, the no barking. Yeah, the Good no, job, the no freaking out. You want that? Gentle. Thank you. It's very serious. Okay, so I think this setup works. I have to call the, for the bird in 15 minutes. I am stressing a tiny, tiny bit because I'm a little nervous that my bird's not going to be okay. But, like, not from the x-ray she's gonna be fine from that she's had that done before but I mean just that it's gonna be something and I'm scared so hopefully that's not the case and hopefully she's fine and hopefully this footage looks good so I have no idea what this looks like I might be I might want like a slightly warmer light but I think this is pretty good for now but now all I can see is rings in my eyes <sighs> okay she needs another hour Okay, sounds good. Um, since the phones are off at three, how do I... Oh, just head in an hour. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Will do. Thanks. Bye. Well, I hope that's not like a... a bad thing. Guys, it's kind of ridiculous just how much this little bird means to me, but you have to know that there was like a time in my life where I lived on my own and I had just the bird. And it was like me and the bird and that was it. And like, she's only eight years old and her lifespan could be like up to 20 years or something. And I would just, I would just be soul crushed if like I did something or if it's somehow my fault that my little bird isn't doing well. So. Anyways, I don't know why I'm telling you this, <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, so there you go. Um, so I'll head in in an hour. Yeah. So we'll leave in like the next 15 minutes. Cause it takes us like 45 minutes to get out there. What are you doing? I swear. Sometimes you're a cat and not a dog. Look how cute you are right now. What's the deal? And you look at you and you know, too. All right, so Tink is, has been picked up. And uh, yeah, let me turn you guys around, hang on. Okay. So the scoop is that, um, the scoop is this. So Tink is in better shape than she's ever been. 
short of a really interesting liver situation. So her liver doesn't look great, um, but uh, yeah, so I don't really know. We don't know what's causing it. She's gonna have to come back because with such a small bird, you can only do so much per vet visit, you know, and drawing blood to do a blood panel, which is what we're gonna have to do, is going to be, it's gonna be a full day experience for her. And uh, when you're so small, it's, uh, <laughs> blood work can be a bit dangerous. So we're gonna go back in three weeks and uh, hopefully, Hopefully this isn't gonna be um, a big a big deal, you know? I, I hope that it's something that's gonna be easy to fix, if there's a, a medication or something she has to go on, um, or what, we won't uh, obviously know for a while. But um, but yeah, if you're watching this and you're somebody who's had liver problems with your uh, paralyt, if you have any thoughts, comments, ideas, or anything, please feel free to leave them in the comment section down below because at this point, I'm just at a loss. I feel like I do everything right for her and I, you know. Uh, we're also gonna look into getting her a spectrum, like a full spectrum light um, as well. But, uh, but yeah, so that's the scoop. That's been the adventure with the bird today and now we're in a mad rush to get home so that we can fly out. <laughs> Make our third trip to Vancouver. Yeah, this is our, gonna be, this is our second time back and forth. Look at this guy, this rock star who's driving me, schlepping me everywhere. I know. Peace. So hopefully we can get this under control. We're gonna do increase like her berry intake and stuff like that. Antioxidants and all that good stuff. But yeah, so if you've got any good vibes you wanna share. I know, you're twittering away. Hi, baby. Any good vibes you have to share would be sweet. Okay, so we've made it home. And here's the little ones. So we're just gonna get you out of here. Hi, honey. Hi. Can you come to mommy? Oh, oh, somebody's a bit unhappy. Oh, here we go. There we go. Okay, focus. Focus on the bird bum. Okay, so I was gonna do a little unboxing, but I don't have time because we unfortunately did double book something for today, so we have to head out now. But I'm gonna do that as a separate video. Just some of the toys that Tank uh, received in the mail. Anywho, um, if you like this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, hit that subscribe button and follow along our little adventures. I'm updating kind of sporadically just when I have time um, to do these videos because I actually do run a different YouTube channel um, as well, so honey, hi. Oh, you're mad at me. Hi, I just want to say hi. I just want to say hi. Oh, hi. There we go. So yeah, if you can sing, send uh, Tink some some get well um, vibes. She overall, um, according to the vet, is in better shape than she's ever been when I've ever brought her in before. Except her liver is just pooched. So we got to figure out what's going on there. But for now. Where are you going? Seriously? Yes, you are going to get a little bit of love. It's going to happen. That little little container of millet. Yeah, you're going to get a little tiny piece of that. Okay, thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Okay, bye!